It's a lazy Saturday. And I got stuff in the mail. I've been waiting for it. And these packages are so dirty. I think something bad happened to this one. And like it was lost. I'm going to have it again. Um, because it took longer than it should have. It was supposed to be here yesterday. So, this is from a small company that you'll never have heard of if you watch my videos. <laughs> Called Jet Pins. So, I got a few things. I got a bottle of ink called Writer's Blood. Ugh, the sun went away again. It's so sad because my nail polish is on fire and you can't even tell. And then we got a couple other things that are protected from stuff like Easy access to them. Like if you ever wanted to like order things so that you like couldn't get into them, 100% recommend. Oh, this notebook is smaller than I thought it would be. Well, that's fine. Doesn't matter. I got some stuff. may not be right. It's just not, it's just a board. Okay, what did I get? I got washi tape. <laughs> it's from my neighbor Totoro, which is one of my favorites. So it's got the little white Totoro up there and then the little soot sprites. Wait, is that right? Well, whatever. Here it is. That's what I got and I love it. And I got some washi tape that is from Spirited Away. So this is hard to see without it being taped down, but you can tell there's no face. And, um, like, that guy that was, like, greedy. No, 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 no. That's the flying guy carrying the fat thing that was actually the baby. And then, like, there's all sorts of people down at the bottom. These are two different tape rolls. We're not getting in there right now. And then I got a pen. This may look familiar if you watch my channel or any of my other videos. A couple weeks ago or something, I got a Twisby Go in broad and clear. This time, I got a Twisby Go in medium in blue. <laughs> so, this one has blue there and blue there, as you can see. And it's still the lovely Twisby Go. Look at that. Anyway, very excited about this. Though, I'm hoping... I'm not regretting because I keep thinking, man, I should have just got another broad. Cause I like the chunky nibs, it turns out. I like, I like the thick writing. Um, but I like these pens because they're really inexpensive and then I can put inks in them that are like harder to clean out and not feel too bad about it. Or any amount of bad about it. So there's that. And what I'm probably going to do is put this writer's blood in one of them. What I was actually thinking of doing is putting the broad nib in here so that I can remember blue for broad. Um, but I don't know if these come out and honestly, I mean, what I could do is just like mix and match and like put this on the other one, but which is over there. I'm not getting up. And then, this package felt like it took forever to get to me. And really it's because it didn't ship for a while. It was like a week or two before it shipped. 
And when you're impatient, that's forever. So I got three things that is actually five things. Oh look, this has a handwriting. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoy. Thanks, I probably will. So look, I didn't buy these because of the name, but I also didn't not buy them because of the name. So this is from Shigure, I think that's how it's pronounced, Inks. And I got uh, this ink that I've never had before. It's KWZ ink, and it's from Poland. And I got the color called Gummy Berry. I've heard these smell interesting, so like I really want to get in here and smell it. And I also want to do that without ruining the nail polish that I just put on. So we'll see if we can manage that. But that might be difficult for me. Okay. I just used my knife as like a prying tool. Um, here's the bottle. This is a big bottle of to get of an ink that you don't know if you like it, but living on the edge. Let's smell this ink. Look, you can't not smell it when one of the things that somebody says they kind of like about it is the way it smells. Okay, hold on. Opening it over the box. Oh, yeah, that does actually smell pretty good. It's got a vanilla scent. So I think they add phenol to these inks to make them not mold. And I think that's particularly smelly, so they'll add scent to them. And I think this one did. So I'm excited to try Gummy Berry. And then I got, if you remember, I got a uh, Colorverse ink set that was um, this Space Launch. So it had Korean Space Launch Vehicle 2, or KSLV2, and it had 75T Rocket. So this is another one by Colorverse, and this is, this is the Red Planet. So I got Opportunity and Spirit, and those are the colors. So here's what's in here. Open it up, and there's like all this space themey stuff. Oh, the, the box kind of got crushed a little. Oh no, it's fine. I don't write with the box. This says, do not use for purposes other than writing, which there goes my idea of drinking it. So here's the um, words about the Red Planet series. It comes with, so the opera, there was Map of Mars and Mars Attacks. And those were pretty, but they were colors that I thought I probably had. Mariner 4 and Allen Hills, 8 4 zero zero one again pretty but no then there was dust storm and uh is this valis marineris probably if i knew more about mars i'd be able to tell you that and these were not my jam they look like a yellow ochre uh, and then there is uh opportunity and spirit which are the two here and then also martian and life on mars and those two are there so pretty cool then it comes with all these things who knows what they are but I don't care I'm excited I think there's little stickers I'm gonna put stickers everywhere um okay calm down and then the two little bottles are in there so you lift up the serving tray and you get a, like all of their inks I think come in these with that come in these two packs you get a 65 mil and a 15 mil so spirit is 15 mil and opportunity is 65 mil and those should be roughly the colors so a, a bright purple and a greeny if i remember right it's a cooler green so em more emerald and then i'm not gonna lie i partly 
bought this because of the name. Okay, but look, you're going to see it and you're going to understand or you're not going to understand, but I, as long as you're not judging me too harshly. And in fact, you know what? You can judge away. Who cares? I got it. This two ink set is Schrodinger and Cat. And the answer to the question that we've all been wondering, yes, you do actually get two inks in here. We'll see. Maybe Cat will be empty. So this was from Multiverse Season 3, and this came with, let's see, Schrodinger and Cat, Gluon and Photon, String and Brain, B-R-A-N-E, uh, Warped, Warped? Warped Passages, Extra Dimension, Antimatter and Matter, and Electron and Selectron. So the, this was a lovely science-y theme. Well, it probably says words. Based on Concepts of Harmony and Symmetry. And then it also came with little stickers. Loving it. Oh, put them back, Maria. Don't get them mixed up. And... What if the cat bottle could had like a chance that it could be empty? Wouldn't that be amazing? It's not. So Schrodinger is, uh, it looked to be like a sort of Kelly green, just like green, green, like grass or something. And cat is a blue, but with shimmer in it. You could see that at the bottom. I'm shaking it up to make it go in there. Anyway, now I have inks, and I got to play with inks, so let's look at them all. Should we do that? How many did I get? Two, four, six. I got this card, these cards that have all my inks on them, so let's just get six of them. You know what's a bad idea is that I just put big fat freaking thumbprints in the middle when I put lotion on recently and that's going to act as a resist for the ink when we go. Unfortunate facts of life. Okay. Can we make you see this somehow? Make you see this. Urgh. This is actually I'm wearing, it's Lazy Saturday, so I still have my lazy pants on. Yeah, look, I made a little table. Mm -hmm. It's right here in front of me. It's gonna flip over. It's okay. It's not. Let's do this real quick. Hi, we're back, and we're looking at my thing here that I that I set up. Um, and we're just gonna look at this washi tape a little closer. So. Oh my gosh, so cute. This is just a box, my little table right here. We're over it though, right? I wonder how they make these washi tapes. Do you think it's like one really long roll? And then they like slice them this way? Just a question. Okay, those those two. Um, super cute. And then... Sometimes you force your way into the packages in ways that maybe they didn't anticipate. Be impatient. So here we go. So this is the one that has no face and the flying fat thing. Who knits? Okay. 
And then for some reason there's also spools of thread. You don't knit with spools of thread generally. You can, but it's not usual. And then these are all the faces of like the bathhouse people. So here's one full thing. And uh, what's his name? Maybe I should watch this. I haven't seen it in a while, obviously. I can't remember. His name was like Hayaku, but not really, but maybe it was. So there's all those. They're super cute. I think my leg is falling asleep. So here's all our things. Um, what do we start with? You always do shimmering inks last. Word. This is a really long video. You're talking a lot. Maybe we shouldn't hassle. I always do this. We're going to have to like, maybe we don't want to rush this. Maybe this deserves its own other video. What I really want to look at is Schrodinger and Cat, but I think I have two that I'm going to compare. Let's look at Gummy Bear. Or should we look at Writer's Blood? Yeah, because I'm going to put Writer's Blood in a pen. We're ready for this. This ink color was chosen by some people on Reddit. Things I know about this. It's a very wet ink. <laughs> so this is I was writing the wrong thing, but I fixed it, so don't be mad. And it looks intentional-ish. Ooh, you know what's interesting is when I first stuck my glass nib in the water to clean it, the ink almost floated on the surface. Okay, we're going to wet this paintbrush. Oh, we got to write the words. Okay, first, I'm going to dip my nib. Stick it in here. I got to cover this. I wouldn't normally, but this is like so precarious right here. How do we write writer's blood? Maybe we put you there. I'm pretty sure it's a possessive writers. Not multiple writers. And if that's the case, then probably this writer is dead because that's a lot of blood to give up. This turned out horribly. Not gonna lie. Um, these pins aren't or these inks aren't really meant to work with dip nibs. It's not surprising when they turn out poorly. You know what? I did this upside down from how I normally do mine because I've been watching this woman on YouTube make so many and this is how she does hers. Maybe I'll make a whole new one that doesn't do it wrong. Um... I'm going to add a little extra up top. So I suspect this is slightly watered down because I had this brush in 
water before putting it in the ink. And I think I'm going to put it in this pen. Because I can. Because I think this is going to look cool. Let's see if we can do this. i got to make sure I've got something if there's drips to catch it. But you can see it's clear here. And let's push this ink through. Not yet. Looked like it was ready, but not really. Precarious. I didn't want to fill it that way because I wanted to see it. <laughs> I'm a child. No, I'm just having fun with my pens. Thank you. Okay. That should help us be able to write. Writer's blood. Hi. So this is probably not the most expensive paper, but it's behaving fairly well. I like it. I like that a lot. We'll have to see if it's like any other colors I have. I don't think it is. It's still all blobby on there. Oh, interesting. Do you see a little bit of like green around the edges? Maybe. Maybe you don't. Who knows? I'm like on a roll now. I don't want to stop. Let's look at Gummy Berry. Yeah. Okay, let's do it the right way, though. What's the right, right way, Maria? The way you normally do it? Yeah, I like that way. Okay. All right, what, who does this? K-W-Z? I wonder, maybe they say Z. You're from Poland. Can't not put that across. Ooh, hello, beautiful. I don't think I was expecting this color, but I'm loving it. Okay. 
I have a feeling a friend of mine will love this too. Maybe I shall send him a sample. See, this ink does not stick to the pen as well. Interesting. Last time I was cleaning this nib, like the whole thingy came out. And I was like, welp, that sucked. Maria, you gotta be super careful. You are like cruising to get stuff everywhere. That one's pretty. Do you like it? I hope you do. I like it. Gummy berry. I might put that in a pen. We'll think about it. It smells good. It smells like cookies taste, sort of. I mean, it's vanilla scented, so it smells like vanilla. Um, okay, should we try the other pinkish one I got? Yes, yes. Okay. Since you've asked. Twisting my arm. Come out of here. The big one is the pinkish one. Yeah. Let's hope that none that this isn't the same as that other one. Because if it is, I have a lot. But you know what? If it is, I can give one away. It's fine. So who does this? Colorverse and it's opportunity. Knock knock knock. Do you hear that? Apparently. It's this little bro. One is always like so like, oh God, help us. It's gonna go everywhere. <laughs> okay, good. I didn't leave enough space. to burn this nib again. See, look, you see my fingerprint up at the top there. A little more blobby. Holy cow, that's too much ink. Oh my gosh, look at that. Yes! Oh, sorry. <laughs> but how do you feel about that ink, Maria? I don't know. Okay, so this is opportunity. Knock, knock, knock. And here's gummy bear next, gummy berry next to opportunity. So they're definitely different colors. Thank goodness, yay. I mean, they looked it online. Get down. Okay, and then should we do 
spirit. Oh gosh, come here, hold it. Oh. I'm just... <laughs> it's not that hard to open, except that you're like, I'm gonna get ink everywhere. Oh no. This is too big. It's fine. Oh man, that's funny. The water turned so blue. Sounded nice, right? Mm -hmm. Last pen. I'm going to be honest, this is exactly what I wanted from this ink. So I'm very pleased. I wanted a cool, cool green. Now we have one of the honkers here. Hoping I like this. This is gonna be this does not want to stick to me. Come on. Don't be like that. Yeah, I think this ink is where I wanted it to be also. Early signs. Yeah. Kind of a sap green. Magenta pink. Yeah, I'm not 
Yeah. And last one. We're going to shake this one a few times as we use it. Maybe I should put this one in a pen. I have a new pen that has blue on it. I mean, pretty much have to. Um, I'm going to think about it, though. So this one is called Cat. Oh, you're still got water on you. Hmm. This is not going to have any. This is too shaken. Ooh, but that turned out beautifully. That's the best word I've written today. He's got a hair. Mm -hmm. Close this and shake it back up. That shimmer just falls down to the bottom. Maybe they should come with like little ball bearings like nail polish does. Dots. Alright, everybody, confuse a cat. Oh, it's shorting your cat, Maria. Mm -hmm. So, we looked at our inks. Um, we already have writer's blood in a pen. That's exciting. I think I have to use something like a paper towel to clean that dip nib or something. I can't use this because the terry cloth just gets like munched. <laughs> so, oh, you can see it's very subtle. Let's bring them back. Oh, no, no. These two have to go together. See, these were really wet. You can see the water reacting in them here. It's like resisting it. It's 
one's going to be my nemesis. Right there, I mean. So, here's the new inks I got. And the little tapes. And my pen. Which is all ready to be inked. I flushed it out even. Um, so, this is a medium nib. Happy day to me! Fun things. Now I gotta figure out what I put in here. I mean, the obvious thing is cat because it's blue and the pen is blue. But I don't know if I'm feeling that. Um, ooh, you can kind of see the shimmer here. I don't know if it'll pick it up said every YouTuber ever, and it never does. But in the word cat, maybe you can focus camera, maybe not. In the word cat, there's like the shimmer. Well, Maria, you are messing it all up. I already have favorites. But this one has too much water in it. I might have to redo it because this is so much water on this card. So, hi. Thanks for hanging out with me when I looked at my new things. Um, also, I'm really pleased because I found, I don't know where it came from, but I found like a uh, phone squidgy holder for this tripod well it's not for this tripod it's for a tripod but it works with this tripod and so like now I don't have to like rest my phone against weird things in order to take videos uh, bonus this is my mattress it's chilling right here uh, anyway thanks for hanging out hopefully this was fun it was fun for me so that's good enough for me <laughs> Have a good day.